What's up everybody, Derek here, and today I'm going in that store right there, Academy. I'm going to look and see if they've got a Pelican Bass Raider 10E to see if what this thing looks like. I looked at the Bass Pro Pond Prowler not too long ago, but John Boats right now are basically off the table. They're not even making John Boats really, or aluminum boats right now because of the shortage of aluminum. And if you find one on Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace and it's used or whatnot, it's marked up big time. So you might as well just go and buy something new, like one of those two-man boats that's going to be inside of there. Or if you're going to buy a new one, the ones that I have found are marked up like crazy because there's such a demand for John Boats right now. So if you want a boat, this is probably the best way to get out there and get to fishing being budget friendly basically so let's go in there and look at these boats 640 dollars right here not a bad looking little boat for 10 foot two i would say it's probably got 17 inch sides here it's got the gunnels it's got the middle but it weighs 145 pounds which isn't too much but it can hold up to 600 pounds a three and a half horsepower on the back and then you can put a trolling motor on the front so you can get this thing set up but for 145 pounds at that price compared to john boats that is not bad at all and the front is kind of aerodynamic somewhat kind of like a kayak so you can kind of get going and not be pushing just a blunt in through the water so i don't know it's really kind of luring me in if I want to pay that for that. And I'm kind of thinking that I might think about it. It's a good looking boat. <laughs> well, I got some stuff to decide and it's got these electric mounts and all these other rod mounts and stuff. But you could put a floor in this thing and set it up and basically make this thing a big bass boat. I don't know. I'm starting to think that that might be worth the price because it's listed at $950 online. Well, I came back out to the truck and Academy has definitely got a good buy going on right now. I went online on the Pelican website and it said $950 and it's 650 basically for that, that Pelican Bass Raider 10E. That's not a bad price, but it holds 600 pounds. It's 50 inches wide. It's probably 17, 18 inches wide or uh, tall on the sides. Holds a three and a half horsepower motor. It's got two mounts front and back for a motor. So it's electrically wired. Uh, I mean, 145 pounds compared to the Bass Pro Pond Prowler. I would have to say that's about a hundred dollars difference because the Pond Prowler was a 550, whereas this one is 650 but it weighs 10 pounds more, but it holds like 150 pounds more, I believe. I think if I'm going to go for it, I think I might pull the trigger. I'm not going to do it today, obviously. The sun's going down, but I think this, this Bass Raider is going to be my next buy for a two-man bass boat or one-man bass boat, and I don't know. It sure looks like something that's enticing to me instead of going out there and buying a John boat for fifteen to two thousand dollars that normally is like a thousand dollar boat so anyways let me know what you guys think in the comment section i'd love to hear what you guys think and subscribe if you haven't already like this video if you liked it i'll see you guys in the next one